2012, paper 1, question 6, we are told three bells ring at intervals of 9 minutes, 15 minutes, and 21 minutes. The, bell, the bells will ring together at 11 p.m. Find the time the bells had last rang together. So we are told one bell is 15, so it's 9. So we write 9, we get the LCM, we get uh, the prime factors of 9, 3 times 3. Uh, we got to 15, the next bell, 15, we get this is 5, uh, 3 not 5, uh, 3 multiplied by 5. We got to 21, we get it is 3 multiplied by 7. So to get the LCM, uh, then we say it is equals to, uh, we take the prime factors with the highest index or power, so we have 3 squared multiplied by 5 is only 1. So we are taking this one, 5, 5, and 7 is 1 times 7. When you multiply that, you get this is equals to 315. So these are minutes. That is the time they ring together. So if you divide, we, to convert this to hours, uh, we will need to divide by 60. So 315. You multiply by six we divide by 60 uh, you'll be able to get uh, when using your calculator you get this is 5.25 uh, so this means we have five hours uh, what about uh, we convert 0 0.25 into minutes so it is 25 divide by 100 multiply by 60 and this will give you uh, 15 minutes so that is that uh, that is uh, we have this is 5 we have this is uh, by 2 is 3 uh, this is 5 so this is equal to 15 so it means they can they can ring together 5 hours 15 minutes now the last they they, they will ring to get uh, uh, together at 11 uh, we write 11 p.m. in 24 hours p.m. Uh, this is the same as 23.00. Then we subtract, because this is the time they ring together, we will subtract uh, 23.00. We subtract 5 hours and 15 minutes. So when you subtract, you carry one here. This is this will be 60 minutes. 60 minutes minus 15, this will give you 45. And uh, then here we'll be left with 22. 22 minus 5 is 17. So this means that uh, the last time they do run together is 17 uh, po uh, hours, 45 minutes, and this is p.m. Uh, so or 5.45 p.m. So that's how you work out that. You get yourself three months.